Alright there guys, what is up? It is the Gaming Center and I am back today with a pretty serious topic. Today I'm going to be talking about how I just got scammed in this game. And yes, I do realize getting scammed is completely your fault and I do realize that. And I'm not going to try, well, I'm going to pin the blame on them, but I'm also going to... Basically the main reason I'm doing this video is just to show you guys who these people are. Just so that they cannot do this again any of you guys. So basically, about... Sunday of Thanksgiving weekend, someone that I was one of my Twitch followers asked me if I could buy him and his friend Evander Kane for the Buffalo collection. Not thinking about the uh, consequences and not asking for collateral, which I've always done in the past. This time I didn't do that. I do not know why. Um, I forgot to do that, and yeah, I basically said sure, I'll send it to you, oh, and then you guys send it back. They said okay. After I sent it, I realized pretty much I had fucked myself, and about two minutes later, the guy who I sent it to left the party, blocked me, so then I was talking to the person who asked me to do it, which was his friend, and he pretty much just said, um, I'll try and get it back, but he was full of crap too, they were just pathetic, little 12 to 14 year old two of them. It was my fault, I will not gonna say that it was my it was my dumbass fault for not asking for collateral in it in advance or something like that. Like I should, the event came was about fifty five thousand bucks, so I would have had around hundred K right now. And I could have actually done the Buffalo collection myself, but you know what, that's how the world is sometimes unfortunately I kinda just it was dumb and screwed myself. So yeah, now basically I only have four G paints out of hundred K, but what do you do? Anyways, I'm just gonna show you guys who they are. Yeah, right there, that's these two. Jets, I asked them, I asked them, I contacted EA, and I got my player, I actually got a player back last year, which is very weird, I don't know why I did. Oh, one second, there we go. Yeah, I got my player back last year, it was only like a 5k player at the time, so maybe that's why, but I basically went to their live chat and called them up, and pr they pretty much said, sorry, nothing we could do, I figured that's what was going to happen, but I, you know, you have to try anyways, and yeah. I reported them both EA, so I hope something will happen to them, but I doubt it will. See, so yeah, as you can see, Sunday. I sent it to him around 1.50, and then about 10 minutes later, I realized I was screwed. I asked him, I contacted the EA. He blocked me at this point, so he didn't get my messages. That's the guy I sent it to. And this is the guy I was talking to, Florida Panthers. He was one of my Twitch followers, and yeah, pretty much I just said, like, he scammed me and he said, what a dick. So he's pretty much saying he's on my side, but... He's not, as you guys can pause if you want to read them. I basically, at the end of it, I just said, I call him pathetic. Because, you know what, anybody who scans in this game is so pathetic that you can't get your own team to play the game properly. But yeah, he pretty much, I just, he called me pathetic, but like, come on. You're scamming people. Yeah, these are their two gamer tags, Jets Dash Slicky and Florida underscore Panthers. I would message them telling them I'm loving this video, but they both blocked me, so there's no way of me doing that. But yeah, they're both about 12 to 14 year olds. So if you get, if you get anyone who goes into Twitch streams, if you guys see these guys and they ask you to do collections, I know Florida Panthers has the exact same Twitch as she does PSN. Do not know about the Chess Slicky, but if they do, do not do collections with them or ask for a collateral player as for someone with the exact same value. I was dumb and forgot to do it because I've always done that in the past. I don't know why I didn't, but yeah, that was my stupidity. I don't know why I didn't do it, but sometimes that's how the world is, unfortunately. And yeah, so pretty much, I still have 40k, so you know what, once the prices actually go down on players, I'll end up doing the buffalo question anyways, and I still have a lot of free packs need over for you guys, so I'll do that anyways, but yeah. These guys are about 12 to 14 little kids who thought they were cool this game, but I thought I'd just expose them, pretty much, and any of you guys out there who have been scammed and want me to expose them, let me know down in the comments, I will invite you to a party and you can explain your situation, I will definitely make a video about them, because I want to expose anybody who scams in this game, because... These are one. These are two of many scammers out there, and you know what? Some people get scammed out of their whole teams, and I feel terrible for them. I got scammed out of one player. You know what? I wasn't even using him. I was gonna resell him anyways, because I already have a Genie Malkin as my first line center. So you know what? That's fine with me. I'm set for NHL 16 for that. But yeah, pretty much. If any of you guys have been scammed out there, let me know down in the comments. I'm not trying to bitch or anything. I know it's my fault for doing it. I was stupid, but. You at least got to let people know that there are scammers out there and that if they aren't banned, that just to look out for them. Because you guys see these guys in your Twitch streams, they ask you to do collections, just tell them to go away. 
tell them to screw off because you know they're scammers. And if it don't work, I seen I saw him in one of the Twitch streams after, and I said that to him. But yeah, anyways. Hope you guys are having a great day. Sorry if this video is a little bit serious, a little bit bitchy, but I just had to let you guys know about this. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have been scammed. I will gladly expose those other guys as well. Anyways, yeah, please like, comment, subscribe for more videos, more funnier videos, hopefully none as serious as this. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.